exist in our minds, some strongholds exist in the church, some strongholds exist in us. So we need deliverance from these strongholds. And, 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 and uh, you're going you're gonna to be able to see it as we go into the class tonight. Um, and all of this is based upon, you know, we've been looking at, uh, let's just go through, the, let's go through this again so that all of us know. Sister Nobuko is going to be all right. Y'all see her over there just, and Ang says she's looking for Mio. <laughs> Amen. She's looking for Mio. It's okay. <laughs> this Mio. Good time. Mio is coming. <laughs> all right. Now, first John, chapter 3, verses 1 through 3. Galatians chapter number 2, verse 20. Ephesians chapter number 3, verses 19 and 20. Right. Praise the Lord. Ephesians 3, 19 and 20. Amen. And, and, and now we're going, to, we, we, we're going to get into this and begin to see this in a... In a you know, this is what we've been teaching here over the past few weeks, and now we're going to get into a place where we're going to begin to see it in a more definitive, more clearer way, all right? And, and, and be able to pull down some strongholds. Thank you, Jesus. First John chapter 3, verses 1 through 3. Behold what manner of love the Father hath bestowed upon us. Mm -hmm. Sister Lisa, would you begin to read? <laughs> First John chapter 3, verses 1 through 3. <coughs> Father has loved us so much that we are called children of God. Mm -hmm. And we really are His children. The yes. reason the people in the world do not know us is that they have not known Him. Mm -hmm. Their friends, now we are children of God and we have not yet been shown what we will be in the future. But, but we know that we, but when Christ comes again, we will be like Him because we will see Him. As he really is. Amen. Amen. And, and so, be, behold what manner of love the Father had bestowed upon us that we should be called the uh, sons of God. And it does not yet appear what we shall be, but we know that uh, when, when he shall appear. So then he's in actually verse 3. Beloved, beloved, now. Amen. Yeah. Now are we who? Sons of God. When? Right now. 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 Amen. Right now. Praise the Lord. Now are we the sons of God. Amen. 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 Now are we the sons of God. Amen. Amen. Do we do we see ourselves as such? Amen. Do we treat ourselves as such? Amen. Amen. And and not all the time. No. And, and 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 you know. And that's one of that's one of the reconciling things is do we really come on? Do we really do we really can we accept it? Can we believe it? Amen. And then when, uh, kick, we, uh, whether you accept it or not, we're going to just plant it in there. We are sons of God. Amen. 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 We are sons of God. Amen. 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 We are sons of God. Amen. Amen. We are sons of God. Amen. When? Right now. right now. We are sons of God. When? Now. All right, God, beloved, now are we sons of God. Amen. Amen. All right. Galatians 2 and 20 says, Amen. <coughs> Praise the Lord. I am crucified with Christ. Amen. Nevertheless, I live. I live. Yet not I, but Christ. But Christ liveth in me. Amen. Christ liveth where? In me. Christ lives where? In me. Hi, right, God. Hallelujah. How many, how many of us pray? Have you ever prayed and, and you wanted your prayers to get beyond this roof? 
to make it to heaven. Huh? <laughs> Praise the Lord. Huh? Where is where is Christ? Christ dwells in here. Amen. Instead of you trying to reach out, you ought to be trying to tap in. Amen. Tap, come on now. It's not praying to yourself, but it's really aligning yourself in God. Lord, I want your perfect will to be done where? In Amen. me. I want to tap into, come on now, this spiritual place. Christ dwells where? In me. In me. Not way out under somewhere in the outer space, but Christ dwells where? In, in me. Ah, Christ lives in me. Amen? Yes. All right. So Christ lives in me. Ephesians 3.19 says that we are filled, Ephesians 3.19. Ephesians 3.19. We are filled with all the fullness of God. We are filled with all the fullness of God. We are filled with all the fullness of God. We are filled with all the fullness of God. We are filled with all the fullness of God. Amen. Filled with all the fullness of God. Amen. Amen. We are filled with all the fullness. Amen. Amen. My God. And now, amen, and, and, and because we are filled with all the fullness, now God is able to do, God bless you, Richard. Good, good. God is able to do exceeding abundantly above all that we can ask or think according to the power that works where? In us. The power is working in us. How many times do we doubt that because of this right here? We doubt that because of issues. Right? God deliver me from issues. <clears throat> God deliver me from issues. Amen. God deliver me from issues. God deliver me from issue. Hey, Mio. <laughs> God deliver me from issues. And sometimes issues can just wear you out, right? Issues can wear you out, right? <laughs> <laughs> Praise the Lord. <laughs> Amen. Oh my God. <laughs> Y'all go on and do it. Get it over with. Hurry up. Please. <laughs> Please. Please. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> <laughs> Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. <laughs> How many years they did not see it? Yeah, they didn't probably see it. Did like 15, 20. <laughs> wow, 20 years? <laughs> wow, they don't see each other for 20 years? Um, wow. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Sorry, no. It's over there. It's a box of tissue. <laughs> box of tissue. <laughs> 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 All right, we got that out of the way. She got the box now. Okay. Speaking about issues. Back to the issue. <laughs>
Church, this is where we have most of our problems because we, do, we feel like because we got issues that